Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange. I was gonna stop last episode, but we're in the middle of something. That was David Madsen. Flashlight and a stick. We are so invisible. Let's bail. Wait, turn around. They're coming. We have to find another way out. Oh, this is bullshit. You can't go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? Uh, okay. Into the car. Get in! <laughs> Later, fuckers! Max, you rock! We are so fucking awesome! <laughs> yes, we so are. They didn't see me in there. No worries. There's no way these freaking saw me in there. No way. No way. This will be the perfect time to go through his things. Or not. Okay. Gotta share the bed. I hope I didn't sleep on the floor. Yeah, they did. Oh, I'm sorry. I need to do something. One moment. Okay. Is everyone still there? Yeah, I had to turn my heater off. Always remember this moment. Photo bomb. Photo hog. It feels like a different world from yesterday. Where did I get these other clothes? We from? left a skid mark on Blackwell last night. Like it needs another one. Wait. Are there cameras in the school? I'd like to do something good for my school in Arcadia Bay. I can't even submit my photo to represent. I just don't want to be rejected. Every great artist gets rejected before they get accepted. So you have to enter a photo. Even though I'm pimping the school in town you want to torch? Come on, I don't want to see Arcadia Bay burn to the shore. I just say shit like that because I've been trying to get out of here since... since you left, basically. I could find Rachel, then pay Frank off. I'm still leaving to start a whole new life. Wish we could just hang out all morning like we used to. Maybe we should get up. I have to get back to Blackwell soon. Oh, does the schoolgirl have a test today? I'm starting to feel like going to Blackwell every day is a test. I just need to get on my regular school schedule again. I know that it is free. Waving at the taxis, they keep turning their lights off. I'm so wiped out from last night. But it was awesome. 
I have to ponder what kind of criminal I've become. Last night was only the tip of the iceberg. I have to admit, it was pretty cool to take over the Black World Gym. Today the gym, tomorrow the world. We need to step it up. We still have to be careful how I use my power. I don't want to get stuck in time. Sidewalk and the pigeons and my window oh. reflection. Mm -hmm. Oh, I enjoy this. That's fine. Just tired. Yeah. I was wondering, are, are we getting up or do I need to press something? Okay, I need to get dressed now. Let's see, Dan Blow, Blackwell, last night. Almost glad. Somebody takes now. I'll let you take care of the popcorn and now the way words you can't back out now. So many men stronger than me have thrown their backs out trying to live. Yeah. I'm lucky David didn't bust me for acting like it was my pot. Nice. Chloe put my pic on her phone. I must have proved I was worthy again. Jesus. Now I am glad Chloe took that money. This guy is serious and scary. Yeah. That's got to stick up hang. Ugh. Still reeks like a chlorine factory. See if you can find a suitable outfit in my fashion hole. Oh lord. What am I gonna find in here? Okay, time for some Chloe cosplay. Hey, there you go. Rachel left a bunch of her clothes with me. She's your size. But not quite my style. Max, you don't have a style yet. At least give it a try. You can always rewind back to your chlorine brand t-shirt and generic jeans. You suck. I like my shirt and jeans. But it would be cool to try on Rachel's clothes just to see if they fit. Stop second guessing yourself, Max. Put this on and let your inner punk rock girl come out. You can afford to take chances whenever and whatever you want to try. For example, I dare you to kiss me. What? I double dare you. Kiss me now. Do it. Damn, you're hardcore, Max. Now I can text Warren and tell oh. him he doesn't stand a chance. Unless he's into girl and girl action. You're such a dork. I'm well, surprised she didn't. Oh man, that was priceless when I kissed Chloe. She didn't think I would. Huh. She might actually want that. Oh, God. Am I gonna have to decide between Warren and her? Oh, no. Looking sick, Max? A couple tats, some piercings, and we'll make a thrasher out of you yet. Ready for the mosh pit, Shaka bra. Maybe not. Go on down and say hi to Joyce. Free breakfast? I have to, uh, wake and bake first. I promise not to tell. Let's not rewind and find out, okay? Yeah, I'm actually just gonna head out. We've been seen a bunch of this stuff before. Oh my god, that smells so amazing. It's like when we were kids here. It's called cool. Phil. I want to thank you so much for your actions with Madara Kate. You showed true grace and bravery when you went up to that roof with her. You must know we did all that was possible in Kate. That Kate's life was never in your hands and hers at that point. You guys left us for another world. Sure, she'll all blessed life. Our family will forever include you in our prayers. Peace and joy, Richard Marsh. Oh, her dad.
Good morning, Joyce. Rachel. Uh, uh, I mean, Max. Oh, you startled me. Well, you fit those clothes well. Thank God you're not a hellraiser like her or Chloe. Now tell me exactly what you want to chow on. <gasps> pancakes. I'm dying for some of your famous pancakes. I thought you would have missed those. Ah, you ate more than William, and he loved them. <laughs> I remember. We would race each other to grab them from a stack. So this time, you can help me with the ingredients. I need you to grab me the eggs and milk. Eggs and milk? No problem. Eggs. The eggs always come first, as Joyce used to say. Wowzer. Chloe still eats the same cereal. So do I. Eh, cereal. I love that they still have the same refrigerator. Milk. Mil milk is in the fridge. Hello. What the? Now for the mother's milk. Thanks. After all these years and everything that's happened, it's great to see you and Chloe together again. She hasn't had a good friend since you or Rachel. Oh, those clothes remind me so much of her. Such a sweet girl. I'm just hoping she's living large in L.A. I'd love to think that too, Joyce, but... We are on the same page, Max. I keep hoping that Rachel will show up or even send a message to Chloe from Hollywood. Or... Wherever she is. Be honest, Joyce. Do you think Rachel is okay? God, I hope so. She was, is, smart. And she always landed on her feet. Maybe I don't know her as well as I thought. Maybe Chloe doesn't either. Sometimes I feel like I don't know Chloe as well as I thought. Max Caulfield, are you actually jealous of Rachel? No, maybe. Maybe. Rachel was so much cooler than me. Oh, you think? Then why has Chloe been telling me she wishes she could be more like you over the past five years? Doubt it. Um, did she really? Five years ago feels like a thousand now. And that makes me what, a century old? You're only 18, Max. Oh, youth. If only I could go back. It's not all that, Joyce. Voila. A breakfast fit for us queens. And a king. <laughs> go sit at the table. I'm just gonna stay. I'm ready. I'm ready for pancakes. Oh, no, it's you. Okay. <sighs> Thank you so much, Joyce. I'm never leaving this table. Good. You can clean. <laughs> oh, plant. I guess nobody waters the plant here. Oh, that's rude. Hey, where's the syrup? I'm glad that's creamy and not crunchy. Kate's life was sure worth a nice exploitive headline. Hmm. Seeing you again, ah, oh, made me remember so much. I know these photos don't measure up to your work, Max. My favorite photographers probably take pictures similar to yours. You make David happy, Joyce. He wants us all to be happy, Max. He's just not great at showing it. Uh, I don't think I can rock this outfit like Rachel. You have your own cool style. Wow, sir. 
I totally remember that day. I'm glad. William took this picture with his instant camera. <laughs> oh, it was the last picture he ever took. He had his car out right after this, and... and... I know, Joyce. I'm sorry. I didn't show you this to be morbid. In fact, I want you to have this. This was when my baby was so full of life and light. She was hopeful, positive, and everything she's not today. And this was the last time I ever saw Chloe truly happy. Did you guys have a bonding session about how fucked up I am? It's not always about you. Chloe, please. It's too early to start picking a fight. Feed instead. I'll keep the warden busy while you go peek in the garage. Now stop whispering or I'll know you're talking about me. Stop being so nosy, mother. Jeez, I can't do anything around here without everybody getting up in my shit. Oh, no one can even joke with you, Chloe. You fly off the handle like that. Excuse me, I have to use the bathroom. Sure, run off and pee when you should back me up. Now who's being paranoid? Just listen to yourself. Nobody else does. I do need to get into David's computer. He's got to be hiding shit. Yeah, probably. But we're going to do that next time, okay? So, as usual, guys, thank you for watching. I know it's a little early, but this is a checkpoint. Probably. And I need to get to sleep. Alright. See you guys later.